Heartworm Disease in Dogs. Heartworm disease in dogs is the result of an infection by a worm, Dirofilaria emetis. Heartworm infection is acquired by dogs after an infected mosquito takes a blood meal from the dog. To understand how to prevent heartworm disease in your dog, let's take a look at the life cycle of the heartworm. The life cycle of the heartworm begins when a mosquito feeds on a heartworm infected animal and ingests an immature microscopic stage of the heartworm called microfilaria. Once inside the mosquito, the microfilaria develop into infective larva within one to four weeks depending on external temperatures. When the mosquito takes its next blood meal from a susceptible host such as your dog, the infected larva are deposited into the skin surrounding the bite. The infected larvae grow into the dog's skin for up to two weeks before migrating through the animal's body in the bloodstream. After about two months, the larvae arrive in the pulmonary artery, where they will complete their maturation to adult worms in the following three months. Once in the pulmonary artery, the young adult worms fully mature. Adult female heartworms can grow to 12 inches in length. Mature worms will mate and produce offspring known as microfilaria that are released into the circulation. The microfilaria circulate throughout the body waiting to be taken up by the biting mosquito. The entire process from the initial mosquito bite to the adult female worms producing microfilaria requires between six and seven months depending on environmental temperatures. Adult heartworms can live three to five years in your dog's body. The microfilaria that they produce can survive one to two years in the bloodstream, awaiting a mosquito to ingest them to restart the heartworm life cycle again. All dogs are at risk of contracting a heartworm infection. Regions with constant temperatures above 65 degrees experience heartworm transmission year round. Northern climates that experience cold winters may have a break in the heartworm cycle during the colder months. Infected dogs show many different signs of heartworm disease. While coughing, exercise intolerance, or tiring easily are seen in most cases, it is important to note that some dogs only show a decline in general condition. Heartworms initially cause damage to the blood vessels around the heart. Over time, the inflammation spreads to include the lungs. The lung inflammation produces the classic cough and breathing difficulties that are associated with heartworm disease. Left untreated, the worm burden multiplies and the worms begin to move into the chambers of the heart, impairing function. If the infection still goes untreated, the ever-growing population of worms begins to migrate toward the liver with acute death typically happening shortly thereafter. Heartworm infection creates a tremendous stimulation to the dog's immune system, resulting in a profound inflammatory response throughout the body. In the majority of cases, heartworm disease that is untreated will result in a dog's early death. Diagnosis of heartworm infection involves a simple blood test. The blood test commonly used, called an antigen test, detects small pieces of the female worm's body. If the antigen test is positive, then further testing needs to be done to determine the extent of the heartworm infection. Additional tests used to stage the disease include a blood test to check for the presence of microfilaria, chest x-rays, and an ultrasound of the heart. Based on the results of the physical examination and these diagnostic tests, your veterinarian will determine a plan for treating the heartworm infection. Safe treatment of a heartworm infection is done in phases. The goal of the first treatment phase is to kill the adult heartworms. The only licensed effective treatment for a heartworm infection is an injectable drug administered only by your veterinarian. Treatment for heartworm infection is not without risk. The injection can cause serious adverse reactions, which your veterinarian will discuss with you prior to initiating therapy. The dog's immune system destroys and eliminates the dead adult worms. This process of destruction creates a tremendous amount of inflammation in your dog's body. Your veterinarian will advise you to confine and strictly control the movement of your dog for several weeks after treatment. 
as this is a dangerous time for your dog, it will be critical to completely follow all instructions given by your veterinarian. As the adult worms are being treated, your dog needs to be started on medication to kill the circulating microfilaria as well. Eliminating the microfilaria is important so that your dog does not act as a reservoir to continue the spread of the heartworm. To avoid this risky treatment, protection is the best medicine. The main goal is to avoid this potentially fatal disease altogether. During your pet's wellness exams, your veterinarian will discuss a heartworm preventive medication that will be best for your dog. Available in tablet, chewable or topical forms that are given every 30 days, today's heartworm preventives are affordable, safe and effective. For convenience, some of the heartworm preventive medications are combined with drugs that prevent and control infections by intestinal parasites, fleas and ticks. Ask your veterinarian about which preventive is best for your pet. Prevention of heartworm disease, not treatment, is always the goal for protecting our canine friends.